Hi, welcome to our virtual open house. We know that things will look a little bit different this year, but we wanted to make sure you had some good information going into the first day of school. If you have any questions after this presentation, our contact information will be on the last slide. Please don't hesitate to reach out. Hello, I'm Cassie Kepples and I will be your child's math and science teacher this year. This is my 11th year teaching fifth grade at CCMS. My husband and I have two boys, Jonathan, who is 12, and Jacob, 7. A few of my favorite things are spending time with my family, drinking Dr. Pepper, my dog Bojax, and watching the Hallmark Channel. Hi, I'm Miss Haley Alexander. I will be your child's ELA and social studies teacher this year. These are my favorite subjects, and I hope that I will help your children love them too. This is my third year teaching with Miss Couples at CCMS. I'm currently earning my master's degree in literacy from UT Martin. My husband is also a teacher. He teaches in McNary County. We live in Henderson and have a cat named Sheba. I talk about her a lot. A few important details regarding math and science are that multiplication facts are a huge building block for a majority of our math standards. Please encourage your child to practice these at home. Homework in math will consist of about five math questions each night, and your child will have math notes to help assist with these problems. And please encourage your child to study their science vocabulary words each week. There will be science notes in your child's binder. Please leave these in their binder. We use these in class. However, there are practice vocabulary quizzes that can be found in the science notes that they can use at home to help prepare for the quizzes. Tests and quizzes are not scheduled for certain days. We will test after we finish a topic and I will communicate home when those assignments will be given. This year in ELA, we have a new curriculum called Wit and Wisdom. In this curriculum, we learn through reading. We'll be reading several novels together as a class. As we grow our academic skill set and our reading skills, we will also be growing our minds and hearts. This is my favorite thing about teaching ELA. Graded material in ELA is different in each module. I will make sure that I'm communicating frequently uh, to you so that you know when graded assignments are coming up and we'll always prepare together for these assignments in class. In social studies, we will have an interactive notebook that we will put information in in class and you can use this as a study tool. We'll have a weekly pep quiz each Friday that will cover the content that we have put into our notebooks. A few of our team routines, one includes breakfast. We ask that if your child is going to participate in breakfast that they arrive in plenty of time to eat breakfast and get settled for the day because class will start promptly at 8 o'clock. We both have redo policies for failing grades in our classes. If this becomes something that we need to discuss with you because of a failing grade with your child, we will make sure to reach out and have make sure that you understand our redo policy for each subject. We have several precautions that we're taking this year due to the COVID pandemic. We will be distancing in our classrooms as much as possible, uh, sanitizing as much as possible, and both of us will be wearing masks at all times when students are in the building. We will also be strongly encouraging students to also wear a mask, especially when we're doing group work and other situations in the classroom when it's really hard to distance. We understand if this is something you're not comfortable with and we will not mandate that your child wear a mask in the building, but we will definitely encourage it. Birthday goodies. We ask if you are gonna send something for your child's birthday that you send it to be consumed at lunchtime, and also that this must be individually wrapped items. Also, our classes are a nut-free zone, so please be cautious of that on birthdays and when packing your child's lunch. Graded paper folders will come home every other week. Miss Alexander and I will both have our papers in the same folder, but we ask that you sign for both sets of our papers, there will be two places for you to sign each time the folders come home. 
We both want to stress that we have open communication. We're all on the same team and we want you to feel comfortable to reach out at any time if you have a question or a concern. There are many avenues you can use to reach us. We have Class Dojo app, you can reach us on that, uh, the school phone, the Remind app through the district, or by email. Our team behavior system is Class Dojo. Class Dojo is a point system uh, where students can either lose or gain points depending on the behavior at school. You'll be given a form on the first day of school that will show you how to sign up. We have a variety of awards that students can cash in their points for. We also will continue to use the Eagle Buck system as a school-wide reward system and students can buy a lot of really neat experiences with their Eagle Bucks. Our promise to you, we know this year is going to look a little different. We want you to know we are taking many steps to have safe classrooms while also making sure we will still enjoy learning together every day. We both love to have fun. We promise we will continue to make our classroom places that you want to be. You belong here and we can't wait to meet you. You may not always be able to see behind our masks, but we promise we are smiling. Here's our contact information. It's just our names at chestercountyschools.org. The school telephone number, 731-989-8110. And please join our Facebook page, Alexander and Couples 2020-2021. We are a Title I school, and Title I status is just that we use federal funds to benefit all students. See you soon.